いいよ Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Favourite for joining me today. So I've come to Sheffield and we're at Greno Woods. This is basically Steve Pete's stomping ground. And I'm gonna go and find this downhill track that they've got over here that's meant to be quite epic. They held a race on it, so it's gotta be pretty special. I've seen a little bit of footage of it, like highlights, so I've got an idea of what I'm in store for, but I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've come here on a bit of a mission. We have a little ride round, we'll see what there is. There's plenty here, I'm sure, so we'll have a little adventure together. Let's go get it. Right, well, this is the trail map. Downhill bike trail, <laughs> that sounds ominous. So you've got one, two, three different trails. So I think we just go, we're here. So I think we go that way and we'll have an adventure. <laughs> Wish me luck. So after a little climb, we've got this number two here which does actually say mountain bike trail. So just seen two walkers go that way. So I'm gonna drop into number two and see what it's like. <laughs> this might be quite Larry. Steve Pete's training ground. <laughs> Chill, see what it is. So I probably weren't the one. Oh, that'd be nice. We go right. Yeah. Oh wow! Look at that view. That's crazy good. Nice. Oh, lovely. That's all right. Plenty of rocks. <laughs> Case onto a rock, then I think. Not an ideal. Still, it's alright though. Yeah, nice. Right, back at the top. For a bit of info, it's not a steep climb, I'll just come back up, but it's a gradual climb. It's not very, very long. It's enough to get the, the blood pumping though. I'm not sure which way to go, so if I, I think if that was say the middle trail or the first trail, I've got, I'm going to go left, I'm going to see where that takes me first, and then I'll report back. But I'm not sure. So I've just gone down that one, we're going to go left. Right, I've just spoke to an absolute legend, local lad, walking his juke, and he sent me the right way now. So there is two tracks up here. So that first one I did is, he reckons, the worst one of them all. And you've got a racetrack up here, and then there's a new one they put in as well. So we're gonna head up here now. This is the first one I've come across. And he reckons, local legend, what a guy. He reckons there's one further up that's a new one he hasn't ridden yet. I think this is the track that they do the Steel City downhill race on that Petey turns up to and usually creams everyone or his boy will nowadays but yeah I'm gonna go up that way we're coming back I'm gonna go up and find this new one the legend says he hadn't rode it so let's go and have a look see what it is oh, I found it oh so we've got an epic view Got an epic view for you on the way down. <laughs> okay, he doesn't know where this one ends either. <laughs> he doesn't know where it comes out or anything. So I think we just chill. Yeah. 
there in the double. That'd be nice. That's a big double. Fair play. Oh, that's a pump bump. Decent sized table that. Another decent sized table. And another one. These, oh, look at that. That'd be crazy good. Some slabbers. Oh, that'd be a big set down. Fair play. Big shot off here, look at that. Woo! Oh, that's epic. This looks brand new, look. Looks like it's been ridden about six times. Look at this. This is all new. Never been even finished. Wow. Cool. Okay. That trout is crazy. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That new track, as the local legends put it, that is awesome. They haven't actually finished the bottom, so I'm not sure if I should be riding it or not, but there was definitely tires on the track, and apart from the very, very bottom section, it looked absolutely fine to ride. So I think I might not do it again just to not upset anyone but this track is legit this one is the one that they do the race on well i'm saying that because it's the only one left up here that i haven't rode and the race is held on this side of the hill there is more tracks on the other side of the hill but today we're going to try this one out so a bit of a climb up, I ended up coming up a walker's path, which might be the right way, I'm not sure. But either way, it was, uh, it was a long way round, but we'll keep riding up, we'll see if we can find a better way up. Right, have a little roll down. This is the racetrack. Whoa. That's a gap and half. You're going to be sending into another gap there. Yeah, fair play. I think at race pace you, you do have no problem. But chilling, not so much. Definitely get that. Oh, trickery. Which line did you take? The big shark fin there. It's still going on that other line as well. Oh, wow. Definitely worth adventuring if you feel like it. I reckon you could spend a little while here and all. Alright guys. How are we doing? Go again. <laughs> Crazy good if you hit that fast. Them jumps are massive. The track is fast though. And if I 
I'd go a little bit faster, I'd be making these. It's fair play. The track's been designed to go fast, definitely. Fair play to trail monkeys. one sit track that is cool there we go there's a little mini guide of Sheffield riding didn't even touch them woods and there's meant to be loads of secret stuff really gnarly off piece stuff so that's pretty cool but the woods I was in went on them three main tracks and they were all epic the newest one as the local legend says that's not quite finished so I didn't really want to ride it again to be fair but there's massive diggers at the very very bottom so but what, what was there was sick so that's really cool and if they're going to finish it off as well it's going to be insanely good and then the middle one where they do the racing on that is epic absolutely epic track really want to practice and ride that some more I think if you had quite a few runs at it and played all day you'd nail most of that if not all of it so and then the last one that was over there yeah it was good it was okay i think maybe it's because it's my first run of the day and everything uh put me off a little bit but in fairness i think it's one of them lines where you need to just pick and choose your way through more than light speed so it'd be good for line choice and keeping your head up so yeah good in all but yeah i'm gonna carry on the rest of my mission so there's a little mini guide for you here at sheffield and the place is crazy good you've got to spend the day here maybe two days really I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed I'd really appreciate it. We've got some epics coming up and I hope you can all join me on the ride. But for now, until next time, stay awesome, see you on the hill. Peace.